of Lewis in the Outer Hebrides. Wonderful place to be again. Much more rugged even than the west coast of Scotland where I've already shown you on video. And I hope to explore in a few days just around the coastal areas of the island, um, do a little bit of demonstrating for the local art society and do some mixed media work again. We'll do some watercolour, we'll do some oil painting um, and we'll do a little bit of pastel work as well. From this video then I hope to link on to go, taking a trip to Portugal. Portugal again very very different, we'll have the red roofs, the white cottages, those lovely pan tiles and the blue Mediterranean, quite different to the more dour landscape here on the island. It's soft. The darkness and the shadow of the blue one here a bit. That's fine.
what a colour study. Well, I'm going to use pastel and water only to do a fast study to go with the oil painting. But the weather's so bad on and off, if I use the photographs of the study from here, I should be able to finish the painting later. That should do it. Right. Well, you see, we're getting there. This is just the pastel and water and blending it in. And I've actually been sitting here painting in, in the rains. It's pouring down. You get some wonderful effects. And it's great to be here working into this really marvellous environment. I'm getting a bit wet, but hell, I'm enjoying it. you will go away and say, let's try that. You're not going to move forward unless you take a risk. You have to take risks to learn new things. The, the two problems I find with adult students coming to me, the first one is they were told when they were 14 that they were no good at school. And the amount of bad primary teachers we must have had when we were younger. So I've got to give them confidence back as a teacher. The second thing is education. I want to paint like constable. And they might naturally... <laughs> Well, here we are again, last painting on the island, beautiful sandy bay on the uh, island of Harris. And uh, we've got a nicer morning this morning to try and oil. I've only got two hours before we've got to get back to the ferry, so I've got to try and do this 24-30 canvas in two hours. So the sky first, and I'll put some uh, raw sienna on, a nice gentle wash of raw sienna first of all. The cooler areas, and where I want the rocks a little bit lighter, I'll go back and just dab out the odd little piece of light from amongst them. And we'll come right into there with that sienna, we'll drop into the darks even and, and work our way through places. And we're ready to rub off the masking fluid on the house, so I'll just take my handkerchief out. It should be dry enough here, yes it is now. And we'll take away those bits of masking fluid to show the white again, a bit of luck. There we go. Until there, that's it, that's called the little house. I could use a flat for this, but I've decided to use this oval mop for this job this time. Just a few bits of, just dragging the brush around a bit here in the foreground to give the effects of some distant darks and some of the details in the foreground. Just touching here and there, look. Just to bring the eye forward. And that's about enough, we don't need much more. We'll just a little bit more there, a little bit more here. 